Hi everyone, it's Crappy Kathy here with Christmas in November. We're uh, we're almost to the real month. Um, this is a hop that uh, a few of us do on the 25th of every month. We pull out our Christmas supplies, and um, I have just gotten a, um, a surprise box uh, from Pink Fresh. And it had a number of Christmas supplies in it. These embellishment packs, which I have not opened. And uh, this is one of the papers. Um, this is the, the front side and the back side of the paper. I'm going to use it like that. And I'm going to seam it together with a uh, Paige Evans um, paper that's a pretty green polka dot. And I've got a photo with a lot of red in it, uh, which is kind of what led me to the choice of the red candy cane paper. And it's a favorite photo of uh, getting ready, getting Christmas uh, dinner ready when all the kids were uh, around the table. So there's John and me and Ava and Barrett and Allie and Katie. So it's not, there's not a huge story to the photo. It's just um, kind of one of those, uh, the house was full, our hearts were full kind of things. And I'm actually scrapping this on Thanksgiving day. So my uh, heart is full in that some of these people are gonna be around today. Uh, Allie is off um, on an adventure, and um, Barrett is at basic training. He's at advanced individual training with the second half of what is called basic, I guess. And I'm going to, I think I'm going to do that. I love these. Um, envelopes and such. Let me see if I can find a good title here. I kind of like this Noel, and I could do maybe a cluster down here. Um, so I think I won't pull anything else unless I could have this Maybe like that, I'll set this big tag down here and I'll have that up here. And then I can add some other embellishments down there. Or I could even do this envelope. Maybe even add that to the tag. I'll keep those both out. And I'll put these things away. I'm doing an easy peasy page. I am uh, fresh out of the emergency room with some heart rhythm issues that we think were triggered by um, uh, my latest vaccination. So we'll see. <laughs> we'll see how that works out. I may end up having to have a procedure that would delay a couple of other medical things I was looking at uh, and, and frankly looking forward to. Um, I kind of like, let's say up here, I'm gonna pull this off the table and put that right there. Um, I might, grab a, this is not from the same collection, but if I repeat the uh, plaid of that down there, and maybe put, I can enhance the um, shadow, I can make it stand out a little bit more by using some um, foam tape behind it. Um, I can, by, by repeating it, it kind of makes it a little bit, uh, it makes it uh, match, shall we say. 
I'm going to do it like this. And then I thought I would add a, um, an ornament or something in here. Maybe even the word joy. I like the, the word joy there. Um, let's see if there's anything else that works. There's Holly Jolly, and I could add a candy cane, and that's red, and it's a little less, a little more, um, I, I want to say childlike, and, and since there are kiddos in the photo, that might be appropriate. So if I put this right here on a nice big piece of foam, let's get it on there and I think this is going to have to be cut down a little bit. So yeah, I'm very uh, happy to be home and um, feeling good enough to cook a meal. Um, let's do that. And then I've got this to put on. Here, let's see. I actually have a thin piece of foam that can go there. And that can go like that. Okay, now, having kind of decided on this, I'm going to put, I have some foam behind the photo, so now I'm going to add some tape and make it even across there. I guess I need to do this. Do this. Add it. Let me line all this up. I'm a little bit disheveled because, to be honest, I had forgotten about this. I did a, a whole bunch. I thought I was leaving tomorrow to go visit my sister, but because of the medical issues, I won't be able to do that. And uh, so thinking that I was leaving, I did a bunch of uh, videos ahead of time. So, I, I, as it turns out, I'm not leaving, and I will be around on, uh, on Saturday when this goes live. And I had a re got a reminder on my calendar <laughs> this morning that this was coming up. Okay, so I'm gonna put this here. And now let's worry about, oh, we don't have to worry about it actually. Let's work on, ooh, that's kind of cute with the, there's, there's a, some of this gold here. So that was why I was attracted to this. But on this side, there's actually some stars. And then I add this. Could maybe add it like so and make this and then I could put something else coming out of there but I still think I like it on this side better so let's do this I like the stars but not as much as I like the that trim. Get it down here. And I'm going to add some foam behind 
this envelope. Put it like so. I love this um, green tone on tone plaid. It's kind of nice. Let's see. I think if I move it over this way, that would work well. And then I want foam behind here. Got Put it here, and then I can put something decorative there. Let's see, we have these um, wood accent pieces. And I'm kind of liking There's this one that says ho, ho, ho. This one that says nothing. And I kind of like that. But this isn't far enough over. So I'm going to push it over a bit. And then I will add some foam over on this side to bolster it up. And I know that I had foam under here. I'm hoping that you all can see that. Uh, let's see. I want here. And maybe another layer. Let's see if that's going to be necessary. Oh, I have it on the wrong side. I knew I was doing something wrong. Okay, let's see. And now it won't stay. So, I'm going to do that. Okay, that's perfect. And... Now I need something kind of coming out of here and maybe a um, I could do the Seasons of Greetings, but that would compete with this for the role of title. Um, I could do this ornament. How's that? Kind of right there. Let me get this with, let me put some foam, some uh, of this foam behind it. Okay, right there. And then um, I'm liking this little bit of holly and a bow. And I was thinking I'd put it right here on some foam. There's a variety of um, types of stickers and I'm really happy with that. I, I'm really happy with the, the surprise box. I was, uh, I bought a couple a few years back and that's kind of how I started 
building my pink fresh stash. And I used quite a lot of, of uh, what I got in that box um, in my Pink Fresh Friday pages. Let's see what else we have that could maybe, I'd like to do something out here and maybe just a little empty frame. How about this little thing that says, Wonderful Christmas, right there. And I wonder if there's, I guess, I could use this right in the middle of there. That's a that's an interesting kind of um, I didn't put foam under here and I should have. I should have done it on all four sides because this is mashing down and I want the consistent, uh, a consistent look. And this little narrowed edge is why I didn't do it but I'm doing it now, and I'm going to do it on the bottom as well. And I'm going to go back and find some word strips and maybe a little, some stuff to kind of go out there. Now, let's see if I can get this up here. Don't do as I do for sure. This is not the easiest way to get this done. It, do it right the first time, as my mom used to say. <laughs> and being one who was always rushing through things and in a hurry and leaving steps off. I kind of like the little 25 here and I think I can put it right there. Let's see, yeah. I like that. Okay, what do I want here? I tell you what I think I'm going to do. Let's see. I'm going to take this. And I'm going to cut a little piece here. I need to put some foam. So Sunday, we were supposed to go, James and the girls and I were supposed to go shopping at Trader Joe's for the, oh, let's see, that's not right size, and it's not the right thickness either. I'm going to discard that and put a tiny piece of this foam here. Anyway, we were supposed to go to Trader Joe's and go shopping, and I wasn't feeling well, so I stayed home, and while they were out shopping was when I, my watch 
yelled at me about my heart rate and I, before alarming anyone, I took an extra dose of uh, medication that I have permission to use when such things happen and it didn't work, it didn't bring anything down or solve any problems. So I had to go to the emergency room and I had to kind of wait until they got home. It wasn't the kind of thing I would call an ambulance for, but I waited for, for James and it was a horrible five or six hours before they tried six medications and finally got, got things going. I, I kind of like this little flag as well. And this one, I will do some more of this foam. And Monday, I kind of slept through the entire day. And And then I think I might add a, how about a sprig of mistletoe. So anyway, I ended up back in the emergency room yesterday. Um, I had multiple conversations with doctors who <laughs> were, let's see, I kind of like it pointing down like this, don't you? I'm going to move this. Oh, okay, this goes back there, and I'm going to move this to the end of that. And now I'm going to place it here and there. Okay. And I kind of like this, but I don't want the whole thing showing. So. Place it under here. And what do I want over on the other side? The most wonderful time of the year. I like that. Um, maybe right here on the frame. Does that seem reasonable? See how we can get that on there. So the upshot of it is we think that um, the immune system response from doubling up on a couple of vaccinations, which is normally perfectly fine thing to do, uh, it, it triggered a strong response in my uh, system and and one of the responses was to accelerate heart rate that's that kind of fight or flight thing that happens to humans and do I like that or do I want it here and if I put it here, right on top of the frame, then that leaves a spot right there for actually something else. And I could do 
a another type of sticker. Let's see. What works? Snow days doesn't work. Or a, just another little frame, a little empty frame. Um, don't have a lot of blue going on there. Or one of these stickers. Little Let It Snow doesn't work. Mary and Bright might be right, but wrong size and shape. Let me just find a little sticker. Um, uh, how about... Okay, I've already got the snow globe here. There is a pretty multicolor stripe there. There's more of the holly print. There's a two-tone blue. Here's a circly one that says Merry Days. And how about putting it right there? Okay, and let's see if there's a word or a phrase sticker that works here. The it's or dear Santa, maybe or fa la la. Dear Santa or Fa La La or Warm and Cozy. How about Warm and Cozy? It's blue, but that means it'll kind of stand out. All right. And I've got one ornament there. I could actually do another one here, kind of down in there and I think I'm done. I like that a lot of this shows but there's a little a little stuff on each side of this cluster so that looks nice to me. Okay, and I think we're done unless I see a something that I just need in there. I think we're good. So I'm going to call it done. Let me, um, I'll probably add some little bit of journaling uh, probably right here on the white part of this tag. I have this on foam. I lifted it up so that I could tie a ribbon there on the, let's see what I've got. I have this red twine. And I think I'm going to maybe double it up and feed it through like so. And then do this. And then cut it. all the way through. And that, of course, will have to be kind of curled around like so. I may as well do that with a little bit of glue in order for it to fit in the page protector without getting all kind of twisted up. So I'm going to twist it up ahead of time and I get to be in control. So anyway, with the change in my normal medication, just an increased dose, 
and uh, constant watching and EKGs um, every few days. They're going to monitor everything and watch it. And at some point, we expect my <laughs> heart to return to normal, or I will have um, entered a new normal. But it's not because of other medications. I'm kind of protected from some of those worst case scenarios. There's no indication that I was close to a heart attack. Um, and my blood thinners protect me from stroke. But I can't quit the blood thinners for the uh, other surgeries without some assurances that they'll be watching for bad things. So that, that all has to be arranged. And if I have um, what they call a cardioversion to try to uh, permanently shock things back into a normal rhythm or a normal heart rate, um, if, if I have that, uh, then I wouldn't be able to have the other surgeries for some period of time. But today is Thanksgiving. I am thankful for these monsters and for that guy that I spent 40 years with and cooked Thanksgiving <laughs> dinner and Christmas dinner for all those, all those years. And um, I'm thankful for all of you being out there and I as we now close down the uh, Halloween and then Thanksgiving seasons we're full full on Christmas so I'll see you next month for uh, Christmas in December on Christmas Day uh, and I'll probably be uh, taking photos of uh, decorations and things that everybody wants to go all out to have the place really festive when Barrett comes home for Christmas. So we're, uh, we've already started accumulating all the things that are going to go up all over the, the yard and the house. So anyway, thank you all for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.